Hi, I'm Troy Vine and I run the Holistic Science Masters here at Schumacher College. I just want to tell you about a short course that I'm running next month. Um, it's on the thought of Owen Barfield and concentrates on the key ideas from poetic diction and saving the appearances. So this is a six week course, it's online, it's an hour and a half a week. And the main intention of this course is to prepare you for understanding these two major works. So rather than going through the entirety of both books, um, I'm going, we're going to select um, passages, key passages from both of these books and look at the, the key ideas in those passages. So in um, Poetic Diction, we're going to look in detail at Barfield's theory of language and in particular his theory of metaphor and how an analysis of poetry can show us how metaphor functions. And I personally found Owen Barfield very difficult when I first started reading him and what I've found over the years is that my study of Wittgenstein really helped understand Barfield so I'd also like so we're also going to look at um, some ideas from Wittgenstein in particular his remarks on Gestalt psychology and by comparing Wittgenstein's remarks on Gestalt psychology and Barfield's remarks on language and metaphor we can then understand Barfield's thought better and we're then going to look at key passages from um, Saving the Appearances and in particular I'm going to follow up on two examples that Barfield gives in that book for what he calls final participation. The examples he gives um, are Goethe or Goethe's scientific works and Steiner, uh, Steiner's Anthroposophy. So so in addition to, to looking at uh, the, the key ideas from saving the appearances, I'm also going to take an example from Goethe, in particular his prismatic studies. So, so we're going to have a little kind of overview of his prismatic studies and read one of his key texts um, about the met methodology that he uses. And then we're going to look at an example from Steiner, um, his, um, we're going to take an example from a book called uh, in English The Study of Man. Uh, a, a literal translation of the German would, would be a general anthropology. So, so we're just going to look at one example from Steiner as well and see um, and, and see that in the context of Owen Barfield's thought. So if you're interested in Owen Barfield's thought in the function of metaphor, the evolution of consciousness, and you want to understand these two works from Owen Barfield, then this is a course for you. Uh, if you want to sign up, then the details are down below and I look forward to seeing you.